I'm Keenan Zimmerman from Kamloops, based out of Kamloops IA. Here we got uh, a little chance to do something a little different as opposed to doing our regular wildfire gig. Something as new as this, you get used to doing wildfire, but you come into this and everybody's fresh. The biggest reward is just working with different organizations and pretty much coming together, figuring out how to do it right and then just seeing those fish get over. Uh, we've got multiple sites around here. We're on site one, beach one, and I'm coordinating uh, the helicopters back and forth for moving the fish. We're lucky enough to get a couple seining crews here from different areas. Generally what happen is that they'll have like a big net on the back of their boat. They're gonna do a loop around the river. We're gonna pull it in, and the bottom is a lead line. It's a heavy line. The top line's corks. We kind of keep that lead line low along the bottom of the, uh, the riverbed, prevent any fish from getting out from underneath. Uh, we'll bring it into the beach and we'll just pretty much scoop the fish all together, get them into those pens and in the buckets as quick as we can. And typically turnaround times will be four minutes, so we'll get a seine in, we'll put them in the bucket, and then we'll send them off. So we have about four minutes until that next bucket. So typically you're gonna be doing around two sanes an hour. Um, so you can expect the helicopter to come anytime between five to maybe even 15 times per hour, depending on how many fish we're getting. So we've got people in the background welding, fixing buckets that have broken, uh, repairing and making new pens for the fish. This is pretty new to everybody and different organizations coming together so I think everybody has really got a good understanding of how much it means to everybody especially First Nations getting those fish over and spawning successfully and do everything we can to make sure that these runs continue to be successful.